Now, a young Kenyan aquaponic farming is, uh, farmer is making a good name for himself thanks to a new farming technique he is applying on his farms. The new aquaponic farming system needs less or even no soil and water to grow crops. As we feature in this report, the young farmer explains of his farming activities that helps him to make produce that attracts a long list of customers. Here are more details of that. Martino Kitio is a successful farmer, but you won't see him tilling the land under the blazing sun. Instead, he starts the day by feeding fish, and Martino is not concerned with fattening up these tilapia. It's their waste he's after, an essential element to this aquaponic farm. So aquaponics is a farming technique that uses aquaculture and hydroponics to basically grow vegetables. It uses the aquaculture component of raising fish in a closed roof system and hydroponics, which is the growing of plants, uh, and plants and vegetables without the use of soil. Katio is among an emerging group of African agripreneurs who are introducing new innovations like aquaponics to the age-old sector of farming. Katio's Mutiro Farms is situated on a two-acre plot in Nairobi, Kenya, and focuses primarily on growing lettuce. One of the key advantages of aquaponics is that this type of farming is not reliant on soil. We can basically grow vegetables where we don't actually have arable soil, so be it on sand, be it where the soil is, is spoiled by chemical runoffs, or where there's maybe a rocky environment, or where the soil itself is not suitable for growing certain, certain crops that would not, would not grow well in that soil. Combined with the fact that aquaponics uses 98% less water than traditional farming and requires significantly less labor, this method can produce better crop yields. All the water they need, all the nutrients they need, everything they need is injected directly into now the roots. What that means is that the aquaponic plant's roots are not as big and as large as those in soil. And, 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 what's, and why is that important to the aquaponic plants? Is because now the plants, instead of spending their time growing downwards, looking for nutrients, looking for water, the same energy that they spend now looking for, them, for the nutrients is what they spend growing upwards. So what that means is that the aquaponic plant would grow in almost 50 to 60% faster. Although aquaponics requires significant capital investment, this type of farming could be crucial to Africa's food security, particularly as the effects of climate change begin to threaten traditional forms of agriculture. And as the global appetite for organic foods increases, Martino is already developing a long list of loyal clients, from online shoppers to grocery chains and restaurants. Hi, Chef Morio. What are you making today? The products are healthy, fresh, and uh, since it is just one, uh, one mile away from us, we get it directly from them. Within less than 20 minutes, it's here, and it's uh, directly from the farm to the fork. From fish tank to table, aquaponics is bringing fresh organic food to homes and restaurants across Nairobi. Using less water, land, and labor than traditional farming, this may well be the future of sustainable agriculture.